Bremen is so good. Bremen and Ferdin, man. So good. Really nice. I just need Verdun to pick up 23, and then he'll be just as good as Bremen. Yeah, the thing is I'd have to make him into a protectorate, so I, I don't really know how well that's going to work out. Although, if he is a protectorate, and he's got tech 27, he's not going to be able to westernize. Not, not until the very end of the game. I might even decide to just stop teching, because, you know... all of his forts? I think so. Look at that. Look at this disgusting fort mess. Oh! Oh god. Ugh. Yeah, hold on. I can't core that shit now. It's probably Sunni. Oh, don't tell me he just finished that. No, it's been there for a while. Yeah, whatever. It's whatever, I'll just give Augsburg to... Uh, Bremen. I know he, he can deal with it. <laughs> He's a beast.
You don't see Croatia converting Vienna? Alright, oh, after he's finished scoring it, I'll build a cathedral there. Ah, uh, the Greek miners all lost their cores. There's no no one there. I checked that. It's a good call, though. Those guys are really good at converting. And they pick religious ideals, mostly. No one cores like Bremen can. Bremen can. Bremen can. No one cores like Bremen can. Bremen, Bremen, women. Bremen, women, demon, semen, lemon, ketemen. Piemen, France. Oh god. Oh no, 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 not Catholics. Can I even give this to Aragon? No, I can't. I'm a fucking retard. The Byzantium is better at converting the harder provinces. Yeah, it's because they've had internal conflicts and they can't get rid of it. It's such shit. When a vassal gets internal conflicts, you may as well just say death sentence. I mean, they just, they, they just it's as if they're gone. And they can still function with internal conflicts, it's just that it never goes away, so we'll never be as good as... It's like a permanent, it's like a terminal disease, it's like... It just doesn't go away unless you let rebels break them. Like the moment I got him, he was like, internal conflict. Okay. I'm sure we'll manage to break him apart one day, and then, you know, that internal conflict is gonna go away and everything will be fine. Ha ha ha. Right, guys? Right? I'm actually gonna give Croatia a little bit, because I don't want Thingy to die. Bremen to die too hard. They're doing so well though. Look at him. Look at him. He's so good. So happy with that vassal. See, I could have gotten him before, but that would have been a bit of a waste because then, you know, like I said, I overfeed them. Uh, at this point, I'd rather have the 6600, uh, but... I mean, both will work, really. So he's got a fort there, a fort there, and uh, like something to connect it. Oh, 
fuck all kinds of duck. Spain is at war with its colony? Shit. Well, there you go, folks. Got greedy. I got greedy. That's really sad. Serves you right, Brazilian piggy bank. All right, Augsburg, here we go. It's only a little bit. And he's not even over 100. But now... to give Peruvian piggy bank some land. It looks like Peruvian piggy bank is going to take a bit more land than I had originally intended because, you know, La Plata and Brazil are now independent. Okay, so, almost there. Uh, at a hundred and eight. figure out who to declare war on next after I have a free diplomat. Also I've got a free colonist. 
and I should probably core the land that I took. <laughs> now he's got someone with uh, three admin. Ah, he's on negative one stab. Shit. What are you doing in terms of stab? You're still alright. Yeah, I am going to be integrating both of those. Get that glorious, genuine straight node and then infinite money. Also, free merchant. <laughs> Making four dockets down there. I probably want to set both on Scottish. I don't know. Okay, so let's check this coalition. It's really not that big. I mean, they should really kind of want to leave at this point. If I fight them now and uh, do it the co-belligerent way, I can full annex uh, all of these, I'm pretty sure. No, because Liège is st uh, stuck. Hungary? Have I dismantled the HRE yet? Nope. So that means that, funnily enough, Bremen is still very much a member. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, okay. Never mind. I was like, what the fuck?
negative 50 to Emperorship because not a lot, but that was uh, just for a normal reform. Th this coalition really should collapse. It really should, because... They don't stare the chats. Uh, it'd be real nice if it did. I don't get why though. Oh, now I get why. Wait! I'm looking at this entirely the wrong way. I can just truce break. Yes. I can just truce break. Like, what are they gonna do? Join the coalition more? They already have negative a thousand. Hey, I just got here. And this is crazy. But you can't get your up. So call me, maybe. Yeah, it's like, what are they gonna do? Are they gonna join the coalition more? <laughs> I mean, you can't join the coalition more. So that would work, actually. Yeah, I'll uh, truce break uh, fucking this guy.
It would call in France and all of France's allies, which means the Pope in Haino again. Uh, the Pope in Cologne. And then just to break them again and then finish them off. And have Europe done. And then we can move on. And that's going to go really fast, guys. Like, holy shit. It's gonna go so, so insanely fast. Uh, I do think I'm a little tired. So, and this is really difficult. So I'm going to go uh, to bed here. But I think what we'll do is we'll choose break uh, Mecklenburg. Can I just start on the rest of the world? No, 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 no. That's really bad. You don't want to do that. You want to focus on one tech group or one religion and we've done that so far and this is the hardest bit you know Europe it's twice the development of Asia so especially near the end of the game we need to like India like all of India is like the size of like, Germany or some shit it's really stupid. Um, about 2,000. Holy shit. We can make that a heck of a lot cheaper though. Because by that time we'll have to, uh, next admin efficiency. And we can pick up this. Which does something really weird. If you, um, if you have admin efficiency. I mean, I could do it on now, because it looks like Provence is going to be finished in 10 years. Yeah, so see, that took that took way more than 20%. Uh, that was more along the lines of 25. It's kind of odd. But, uh, I guess... Uh, yeah, we're gonna go fight Mecklenburg next time we'll two break and uh, that's gonna bring in Bohemia and France and Cologne and Haino and the Pope and we'll eat them. And then the coalition's gonna be like, what? That's not allowed! And we're gonna be like, yes it is. Scumbag. I'm a little afraid of the Ottomans joining though. They could. And that would make this a lot more complicated. Who are you allied with? He's allied with Denmark. You see, I could respect Denmark instead. And then I think the coalition would break apart. In fact, I wouldn't even need to truce break Denmark, because the truce is going to be over January 14. No, it's June 14. It's Livonian order that's January 14. I don't know if I'd want to wait that long. Oh, but I don't know. I'm gonna go to bed. So I'll see you guys again. I hope on Thursday. I have to work on Thursday, but, but, I have to work in the afternoon. And supposedly I have the evening off. But. Uh, you know, I work in the service industry, and when they, you know, and it might just, it might just be all fuckity wackity, you know. It's like they say, no, 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 yeah, yeah. Afternoon, and then you're there, and then it might just be longer than that. I don't know. I, I mean, uh, that, that's kind of shit. On the one hand, on the other hand, it's like, uh, what are you gonna do without me? You know, so. Anyway, um, yeah, I think I'll see you guys on Thursday at 7, so 1900 hours Central European time. Might be a tinsy-winsy bit later than that, 
I don't know, but I'll see you guys again on Thursday. Anyway, thank you for watching and good night.